Hello, um, if you go like first grade or second grade, you know, it's a book for you. Or if you just like watching, like reading short books, this is the book for you. Um, I wanted to get like a little dressed up for this reading. So here we have Clark the Shark, Tooth Trouble. Alright, so on the first page. Clark the Shark, Tooth Trouble. Written by Bruce Hale, illustrated by G Guy Francis. His little name is Guy. Let's see. Clark the Shark loved reef soccer. Flick it and kick it, he cried. But sometimes it didn't love him. Pow, ouchie, ow, ow. His tooth hurt. His tooth wobbled. What if it fell, at, fell out of his mouth? This is him. Getting hit. You know, the ball didn't like him back. So, you know, he got hit. His tooth, his teeth can come back out. You know. You need to see a dentist, said Miss Mahai, the school nurse. What's the dentist? asked Clark. Someone who fixes teeth, said Miss Mahi. I'll call your mother. So, this is Miss. Mahi, the, the, the nurse right here. This is Clark getting off his tooth right here. And so they put a bag of ice on it because it hurts. As Clark waited for his mother, along came his friend, Joey Mackerel. Check this out, said Clark. I go, I go, ow, ow, ow. Cool, said Joey. So he's showing his friends. And this, and, um, this is Joey right here, you know, Clark. Um, He thinks it's really cool. And he and he feels better after he said that. Billy Ray, Billy Ray Ray, join them. I'm going to the dentist today, said Clark, the shark. No way, said Billy Ray. I heard dentists dentists are scarier than a box full of blue whales. What? Billy Ray Ray joined the team, you know. So um, this is them, obviously. Readers, um, that's what he said. He said that. And then they're like, oh my god, he's scared. I, I bet Clark is scared. What are your predictions? I was like, leave in the comments. Really, said Joe? Really, said Clark? Really, really and truly, said Billy Ray. Oh, uh, oh, and oh no, Clark was worried. And the dentists are meaner than a 10 math page test said Billy Ray Ray. Oh, oh, and oh, no. Don't listen to him, said Joey Mackerel. You'll be fine. See, he's bragging about how bad dentists are. But, readers, if you go to a dentist, it's not that bad. All right, it's not that bad. He's, um, he's just like, he's, he thinks that. He had rumors of that. Clark wasn't so sure. When his mother came to get him, he asked, Do I have to go? What's wrong? His mom asked. Billy Ray Ray says, Dentists are mean and scary, said Clark. Billy Ray Ray also told you that whales can fly, said his mom. Oh, yeah, said Clark. Then a rhythm popped into his head. Don't shed a tear, because there's nothing to fear. That's right, said his mom. So, this is his mom and him talking and now he feels better you know he doesn't feel that bad anymore did i gotta show you this picture from before the page before right. at last clock was relaxed and smiled he was his unusual sharky self until they reached the dentist's office and clark got scared thought what if billy ray was right so then i'm going to let me see what it says. Come on in. You know the drill. Dr. P. Odds. What if we don't know the drill, man? Doctor's thinking we know the drill. I've been here before. At the dentist's office, Clark wailed. He hung on the door. And he clung to the chairs. No, he said, you can't make me. It took his, I, it took his mother two dads and a dental assistant to get Clark into a dentist chair. And then, oh, uh oh, and oh no! To him, he's like, he's like, no, no, I don't want to go in. You know? 
be scared. She seems a bit scared. I think this prediction is that I think I'm gonna predict that he finally, um, you know, gets the dentist to get him. It's Kane, the dentist. Hi, she said. I'm Dr. Pia. What has teeth but I cannot eat? Corsara. Dr. Pia was tiny. A comb, she said. Get it? A comb has teeth. You know, he looked really scared from this picture, but you can tell it's very small. And he'll hurt you, you know? Dr. Pia juggled her tools. What time do you visit? What time do you visit a dentist? I don't know. I don't know. Say clock. Tooth hurdy, she said. The dentist played happy music. Dr. Pia was nice. No, the dentist played happy music. Dr. Pia was nice. She had gentle, she had the gentle fins and the silly soap. That was good. You know, you know like, that's a really extreme dentist, you know. Turn all her tools. Very, be very gentle with Ren. Don't want to hurt Ren. Don't want to make him bleed. Well, I guess he'll bleed. I don't think he'll bleed. Um, but, you know, he could get really, he could get hurt, you know. But, you know, it didn't really hurt that much. To be honest, it barely hurts. What's a dentist's favorite animal? Asked Dr. Pia. I don't know, said Clark. What? A molar bear. Hmm, <laughs> that's funny. That's actually funny. They laughed together. Ha 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 ha, roared Clark. Dr. Pia worked in his mouth. And then, and then, that's them laughing at the joke. Yeah, nice to see a big smile, even though the person was like way bigger than you. But you know, here's that bad. Here's that bad boy. Said Doctor Pia. She held up the tooth. The new one will come out soon. Want to see weed lollipop? The next day, Joey asked. So, was the dentist scary? Clark smiled and said, "I didn't shed a tear because there's nothing to fear." And he gave her a lollipop, and he pulled. She pulled up the tooth. You know, a lot of times I go to the hospital when I was my little one, and they used to happen to me. All right. So here are some fun facts, guys. Sharks have many rolls of teeth, so they never run out of them. When a shark loses a tooth, another one moves in its place. Sharks lose their teeth more than once. Some lose up 3,000 teeth in their lifetime. That's a lot of teeth. We only have not that we barely have as many as shark teeth has. Sharks have the most powerful jaws of any animal on the planet. Three fun facts about sharks. That is it for Clock the Shark, Tooth Trouble. And yeah, you know, this is for new readers, you know. It's, kind of, it's not that much pages. A book is very good um, to chill off the time. With the electronics you want to read, you know, really have a lot of fun. That's what I'm showing you today. But you don't get to watch this on electronics, so it doesn't really matter. But you'll be able to read books with me. Um, I'll see you next time in a new video for this. I, I know I usually post Roblox videos, but I just want to like remake all, all my um, reading book stories because I, I didn't read this before as a video. But yeah, I brought back the series so. We gotta read for more little books, bigger books, and I'll see you tomorrow. More. Like I said, I think tomorrow. I, I don't even know. See you.